you see this bottle it's a solid and because it's a solid it has a fixed size fixed shape and volume and the particles inside solids have very strong intermolecular forces and these particles are very closely packed so that there is almost no space between them and because of which they have very low compressibility you can't compress them easily let's now look at uh, water in a container now water is a liquid the intermolecular forces in liquids are neither too weak nor too strong because of that their particles are free to move anywhere within the liquid but hey they cannot escape so liquids do have a fixed volume but as you know they don't have a fixed shape in fact if i pour this let's say into a glass what do you see they take the shape of the container in which they are kept and particles in liquid do have some space between them and because of that they are more compressible than solids but what about gases by now you would have guessed the intermolecular forces of attraction in gases are almost negligible so gases do not have a fixed shape size or volume and uh, since the particles in gases have large spaces between them they are highly compressible 